Hello viewers, welcome to my YouTube channel Knowledge and Education Hub. In this lecture module, we will learn about the semi barygram analysis on Stanford Geostatistical Modeling Software. Before starting this lecture module, if you are new on my YouTube channel, please like, share and subscribe. Okay, let's start. This is my third lecture on uh, SGMS software. Uh, in this lecture module, we will learn about the barygram analysis, how to analyze the barygram model in uh, SGMS software. Okay, let's start. Uh, as we have discussed previous uh, lecture module, uh, how to up, uh, how to construct the data for SGMS and how to upload the data on uh, SGMS data. In this lecture module, we will learn about the barygram analysis. Okay, let's start. For this, go to the barygram. Uh, before going to the barygram, it's uh, go to the information, and here this uh, minimum and maximum of the location point this shows that uh, this is the point location data okay go to the barograms uh, select the geological uh, parameters as we have given name okay number of lakhs gives the uh, 50 lag suppression as you know that the lag suppression is the average distance be between the lag points here the in my in this data set the average distance between the bore is the 14500 lag tolerance is take the 50 because this is the tolerance and separation number of variation take the 3 first take the omni direction for omni direction that uh, Tolerance is 180 degree because it's going to the straight 0 0 tolerance is the 180 and bandwidth is the 100. The second takes the 45 degree from south 0 take the half of this uh, tolerance because from this angle tolerance is this. 22.5 this is uh, 8 bandwidth this is the bandwidth because in this uh, uh, it is uh, error with the data set when going in a straight path and this is this distance is the bandwidth and third step the 0 90 degree deep the tolerance is uh, 15 and uh, 5 this is bandwidth I think this is this have been done ok I'll just ok flip to the window ok this has been uh, construct for the data set for the barygram modeling it is exponential model, change the spherical for the spherical model. Spherical model is in this direction, there is no data set. This means that uh, uh, go to the setting, plot, auto is set to here 0, maximum is here the 0 point, 0 point 0.5 is this, uh, take this uh, 0 point. Uh, apply changes ok I think for this in the order here the plot 3 the way the LMH is 0 it's uh, not uh, coming this uh, because maximum points has gone to the plot go to the setting again plot setting set to 0 0 0.8 this uh, there is no data set for uh, there is no pairing in this uh, window for this uh, uh, check for this go to the setting ok set to 0 and that is 
zero point six apply changes okay. and different dashes is uh, done with the spherical model uh, here the nugget is here so that it is a zero and this data set is a uh, is a demo data set I, I hope and uh, there is no uh, the good fitting of the barrygram but you can use this software for the how to use this software for the barrygram analysis you can easily from this demo data set uh, from this uh, check one thing go to the data analysis go to the barrygram uh, not for barrygram go to data analysis go to the histogram and select the zero points and here the barrier is 0 0.06 and here the uh, variance it means that is 0 0.06 it means this is the cell points for this data set and this point is the cell where the cell is the almost plateau uh, in this lesson model uh, you have learned about the barrygram modeling how to construct the barrygram modeling i hope this lecture model is very useful for to all if useful please like share and subscribe thank you